Hi guys. <laughs> I don't bring una another to re with the soap. So, Mrs. Bliss posted a picture of himself and his wife where they arrived a quiet bomb. It wasn't even Mrs. Bliss. Okay, yeah, he posted it, Sean. So, these somebody made this comment. Like, person made a post saying, without sounding like a hater, I would like to tell this lady to stop dressing like an old woman. Modesty is different from being unfashionable. Your husband is a young boy. First of all, guys, please ignore the noise coming from my background because there are, someone is actually walking <laughs> for me outside. So, yeah, you would hear um, a, a banging noise. <laughs> yeah, that, that sound, you hear it. So, please, guys, be patient with me. So... This I don't I don't care <laughs> God I may go. This came up and I'm like ah people get mind though like Emalaya gone Emalaya gone I like you get mind with your picture and then you posted this without sounding like a word I would like to tell this lady to stop dressing like an old woman modesty is different from being unfashionable your husband is a young boy what do you mean uh, yeah, maybe it's a sense of fashion you know the husband saw it before he went to marry her abby he saw it we all saw that she doesn't do makeup she doesn't wear um drawers you know she do, even on her wedding day you saw okay the phone is Part of it is the comments. The comments are wild. And this one says, seriously, the commenter didn't lie. Another person says, Mesichimo is also a Christian and dresses very smart. Make una live her now, the Ankara Narcissus. If she knows so, we <laughs> all <you> go waste. <laughs> okay. In as much as this is none of our business, but it, the comments are really funny because... Why are you going to chuck mass for person matter? <laughs> Yo, so the, the account has six yards. If if she knows so all, you go waste now. Oh my god, this is hilarious, <laughs> guys. What do you think about? See, just go to Mrs. Bliss Instagram. You will see the full video. It's a video. I do not want to post the video on my YouTube channel. Go through it. You would see what she actually wore and then come back and let me know what do you think about the clothes though she people are exaggerating do you understand or there is nothing you see nothing wrong with it but i don't want to talk as in any ways not in my opinion i won't hear and i wait to comment like me i won't read <laughs> my opinion does not count right it doesn't count <laughs> my thing is Mrs. B saw all this before he went to marry her. Abby, yes, now. No, so Christianity is not supposed to be boring. If people actually read the Bible well, they will see that David and Solomon wore luxury, silk and cotton and gold. They were shining and luxurious. Modesty doesn't have to be outdated. This one says, I would have loved to say the same, but the husband is not complaining, so let's mind our business. Exactly. You get in as much as you want to be a dip, like the husband wrote the song Fine Boy, you love Jesus. The husband is quite fashionable, he loves fashion, he dresses well, he's a fine boy, and, and got he's got the fashion, he's got the swags, he got you know. But it's it's somehow to now see a young lady, you know, dressing the mommy geo kind of. I'm like, mm, okay. No be me go pay your dowry. No consign me. You no consign me. My opinion should be in my mouth. <laughs> I don't get my type of. Okay, my opinion does not count. Your husband saw it before he came to marry you. But still up, even though upon still. <laughs> even though upon still. You no consign me. You no consign you. But the fact that people would Nigerians, when I don't fear, I could just come drop on our comments. Bah. Ah ah Aurora. This one says Sense, stop dressing like old mama. You are a youth, beautiful and sexy. Your husband will get tired of you eventually. Look smart, elegant, sexy, pretty, and well dressed. Stop all this religious madness. 
it eventually ruins and damages don't mix religion with looking good and smart she will make she won't she wants me then they call her mama based on military levels now <laughs> see if you ask me to be honest with you i feel like you can be looking you can be elegant smart well dressed and well put together and be a christian at the same time do you understand take a look at Mr. Chinwo. yeah that's a very good example you will never catch Mr. Chinwo wearing um clothes that are exposing do you get what i mean you will never catch Mr. Chinwo wear such clothes but still when she comes out when she moves she moves with class the elegance is there the the she she commands you know when she comes in the room the aura the presence that she carries is a lot do, do you get what i mean so a woman like mr chinwo is is a very good example that you should use you serve god you love god you're worshiping yet you look good i don't say she doesn't look good though I don't say. <laughs> home training one finish my the handbag every day <laughs> Without sounding like a hey, then she proceeds to sound like oh, oh my god. See, messenger one would step in a room, she commands the atmosphere. You know, her laughter, her smile, the way she talks, the way she like everything. That woman is it. She ah no no no. She's just too much. She's just too much. Yet she dresses her dresses are modest. All the clothes she wears, they are modest on point. She does not have a dress. That's the kind of... That's what I'm saying. That's that's the kind of modesty and love. Dress well, look good, and still serve God. Not, not like you're dressing and you're looking like somebody in your 50s. Because, to be honest, that was how she looked in that... In that uh, picture or video I saw. That was what she looked like. My dear, please, go, go to his page. You will see I'm there. This was it, and this is true because even the husband way be say him carry the anointing self, the dress well and meet well, make she please herself now she know. What if that's what turns us oh god <laughs> Okay, let me skip that I beg, I beg. as long as the husband isn't complaining, you know where to show your opinion about the people's problem. Oh, okay. What if that's what was? Hey, God. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, good for him. Like I said, our opinion is still our opinion. It's not going to change anything. The husband saw that. He saw all of that before he went and paid a bride price. He paid a bride price and full. He saw all of that. And if she's dressed like that, that means he's not complaining. So who are we to complain? say when i get problems honestly even some of you your fashion sense is nothing to write yet you bash this lady her husband saw her and married her who are you people exactly to be dictating or suggesting what you think she should wear make when i get out of it okay that's that's fair enough this one says she really needs to start dressing like a youth that she is for real everything is moderation you don't have to overdo because mrs bliss is always dressed normal so yeah mrs just mrs bliss dresses uh, shush, shush, shush. mrs bliss dresses <laughs> sound and on point and good smart yeah we are going to be honest but still with this what this lady says up there it is not our problem fifth what Nigeria is throwing at you? <laughs> Mind your business. So, guys, what do you think? Quickly go to Moses Bliss channel. I mean, his Instagram or Facebook page to check that particular video. Just go through it and let me know what you think. Come on, drop your comments. I beg. Make me mind our business. Or do you think she should change? At least put efforts in the way she dresses. I look different at least. Do you get what I mean? Okay, guys. Bye for now. Mwah.